Hello everybody, Money Vikings Collectibles here, and uh, we're here to talk about dragons that are completely demolishing our 401ks at the moment, right? Uh, yeah, it's not fun. Um, market is, uh, is going crazy. Uh, talk of uh, recession, you know, right around the corner. Who knows? I don't know. Um, honestly, this is partly why I like collectibles and magic and flesh and blood and comics and all this other fun stuff because it's fun and we don't have to think about um, all this hard stuff. So anyway, investing's good. You know, I'm trying to keep my wits about me. Um, I don't want to overreact during these down trends. In my experience, has always been a good time in the long run to uh, pick up assets on sale. That's how the wealthy get wealthier is they are able to buy distressed assets. They're able to buy things that are actually worth, gonna be worth more in the future, but everyone is so scared um, that they are uh, selling, you know? So that's what we're going through right now. Who knows what the value of these magic cases and, and booster boxes and, uh, uh, you know, Commander Legends uh, collector's boxes are going to be worth, you know, there's all kind of chit chat on, uh, you know, the various channels that uh, it's going to zero. Fine. You know what? Honestly, I don't really care. I enjoy it. I think it's fun. Um, you know, um, you know, any, anybody who's dumping their life savings into this, that's clearly a problem. Um, this is fun. Okay. If it goes up in value, great. Uh, but uh, that's just an added bonus, all right? That's my opinion, sticking to it. Hey, dragons are the thing, right, in Baldur's Gate. Very cool. Uh, this baby's worth uh, quite a bit of coin. So holding on to that one. Um, again, who knows what the value is going to become, but in the meantime, uh, it's just a very awesome collectible to have. I do have here the Draconic Descent Commander's Legends Battle for Baldur's Gate Commander set uh, with the legendary creature uh, Furcrag, the cunning instigator. Really gnarly. Uh, you just don't want to mess with this guy. Um, Furcrag is right here. Uh, even among red dragons, Furcrag stands out as manipulative and deceitful. I've known some people like that. He's happiest when lesser creatures in his, his eyes, anything other than dragons, are strung along by his elaborate deceptions. He uses trickery and his mastery of illusions to turn friends against one another and ruin the lives of the heroic and righteous. Ooh, some of these, some of these guys, wow, it's, it's pretty wild. Uh, so let's check out what is in this, uh, this set. Comes in this nice little fun box right here. Um, I should say, hey, if you don't mind, please subscribe and please uh, like uh, our, our videos if you don't mind, because it uh, just really helps out kind of create momentum and, you know, kind of reinvest into this and be able to bring, you know, more fun stuff. And just, again, en enjoy ourselves, have a little respite from uh, market crashes. So here's Furcrag, uh, you know, blowing fire onto our 401k balances. Um, I would just say, and you know, try to be a phoenix that rises out of the ashes. Um, that's what we try to do. Another mythic came here with this one. It's Baloth Bar Baratol, the Entertainer Elf Shaman. That is just a gorgeous card right there. Look at that artwork. I love it. I mean, that costume design is amazing. So we got that going. Um, we do have our collector's pack here. We'll open in a second. Okay, this comes with Propaganda. We have Curse of Verbosity. I've known a few people like that. Compulsive Research, Sorcery Card. Command Tower. Wayfarer's Bobble. Mind Stone. Burnished Heart. Oh, so cute. Arcane Signet. Shiny Impetus. Psychic Impetus. Oh, we got a Foil Clan Crafter. Ooh, legendary Enchantment Background. Curse of Opulence. Yes, there we go. The Curse of Opulence. <laughs> we have a Sprite Dragon. Oh, Fairy Dragon. That's the cutest one I ever saw. 
Look at that. Oh, I think I get a little dog running around here, which reminds me of that one. Bloodthirsty Blade Artifact Equipment. Equipped creature gets plus two, plus zero, yep, and is goaded. It attacks each combat if able and attacks a player other than you if able. Wow. Fellware Stone Artifact. Hedron Archive. Ooh, look at that. That's dramatic. Okay, we've got the Is It Signet, the Soul Ring, Talisman of Creativity. Oh, I like that. Okay, we've got some lands. Let's put those to the side. Look at that myriad landscape. Ooh, reminds me of Uprising coming. Sorry for all you folks that are pure this or pure that. Yes, I like magic and flesh and blood. I'm, I'm not a hater. I just enjoy artwork and fun games and collectibles. Okay. Temple of the False God. Huh, interesting. Land. Okay, I'm going to look that one up. Terrain Generator. Okay. Artificer class. Very cool. Class cards. Astral Dragon. We've got a flying 4 4 dragon. Nice. Oh, yeah, we've seen her. We got the Mocking Doppelganger. Very nice. Bothersome Qua Qua Quasit. <laughs> Rare. Okay. Uh, Death Kiss. A Beholder. Ooh, nice. Very D&D. Okay, a Loot Dispute. Yep, that's not going to be good. Spectacular Showdown. Sorcery card. Put a double strike counter on target creature. Then goad each creature that had a double strike counter put on it this way. Aether Gale. Return six target non-land permanents to their owner's hands. Ooh, that's pretty powerful. That could really stymie someone. Angler Turtle. Okay, there you go. Curse of the Swine. Exile X target creatures for each creature exiled this way. Its controller creates a 2-2 green boar. That's cool. Oh, check out her. Dissipation Field Enchantment. Very nice. Domineering Will. Instant. Target player gains control of up to three target non-attacking creatures until end of turn. Untap those creatures. Kega, the Tide Star. Ooh, neat. Legendary Creature Dragon Spirit. 5-5. Five, five. Huh. When this when Tide Star dies, gain control of target creature. There's a lot of value uh, generation in this set. I can tell these cards are doing many things for the player uh, at multiple times. In other multiple situations, Pursued Whale. That's kind of a cool card. Look at that. That's a rare. Hmm. When it enters the battlefield, each opponent creates a one-one red pirate creature token. With this creature can't block. And creatures you control attack each combat if able. Interesting. So everybody gets a little bit of a defense, but that's an 8-8, baby. It's going to take a lot to get him out, but I don't know. That's uh, quite the Moby Dick. There you go. Uh, Reigns of Power. Very cool. Untap all creatures you control and all creatures target opponent controls. You and that opponent each gain control of all creatures the others control. Hey, if your opponent has done much better than you and has a bunch of creatures and you can pull that out, you can really, wha really whack them once. Sly Instigator, Human Wizard. I gotta tell you, so far I'm pretty impressed with this uh, commander's deck. This is pretty cool. Look at this. There's a Mythic Planeswalker. I don't know if they all come with this. Will Kenrith. This is a really nice one. Will, the Planeswalker. This is so cool. Wow. I'm going to set that off to the side. Wow. I'm, I, I, this, is a, this, is pretty, this is a pretty awesome deck, actually. I'm really enjoying this pool. Insect, okay. Oh, this is cool. 
the Akron War. Oh yeah, I love these stories, do different things. I love that. Avatar of Slaughter. Okay, 8-8. Eight, eight. Man, there's some really beefed up, uh, you know, fully juiced creatures here. Blasphemous Act. The spell costs one less to cast for each creature on the battlefield. Blasphemous Act deals 13 damage to each creature? Wow, it takes nine to do this, but talk about a nuke. I mean, this is like a nuclear bomb. I'm just going to blow it up. Amazing. All right. You guys are seeing it. Brash Taunter. Goblin. Love goblins, of course. Uh, chain Reaction, yes. Wow, the reds are something else. Chaos Dragon. Look at that gorgeous artwork. Beautiful atmosphere. I love paintings like that. Wow, and I, I like the D20 mechanic, frankly. Okay, Chaos Warp. Disrupt Decorum Sorcery Card. Goad all creatures you don't control. That's pretty neat. Oh, here we got another dragon. Okay, Maw of Flames. Geode Rager. Elemental. Very cool. Goblin Spy Master. Loving it. Hazul, Tyrant of the Cliffs, Ogre Warrior. Oh, I love this. I don't know, guys. Here's another another Planeswalker? Two Planeswalkers? Two, two Mythic Planeswalkers in this Commander set. I, 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 don't, I don't know. This is amazing. I, am I... Tell me if I'm wrong. Please comment. I mean, is this, is this a crazy deck or is this normal? Uh, my last Commander deck pull was not like this. I mean, this is amazing. We have a Kenrith. Okay. Okay, the Falling Star, Dragon Spirit, Territorial Hellkite, Thunder Dragon. Love it. A 5 5. God, you get these dragons out, you're forced to be reckoned with. Yep, that's an oldie but a goodie. Warmonger Hellkite. Niz Miserit Parun, Legendary Creature Dragon Wizard. Beautiful, rare card. Yes, I'm familiar with that one. Beautiful. Dragon's Horde, look at that, all the gold. Whenever a dragon enters the battlefield under your control, put a gold counter on Dragon's Horde. Remove a gold counter from Dragon's Horde and draw a card or add one mana. Solemn Siculacrum, a golem, I love golems. Steel Hellkite and Dragon. Yep, Stuffy Doll. Castle, okay, Castle Land. Got it. Uh, Desolate Lighthouse Land. Kerr Keep Land. Temple Epiphany. A lot of a lot of flavor with these lands. A lot of a lot of ambiance created here. Looks like we're basically lands from here. Islands. To do some mountains, of course. It's a red and blue. And wow, look at this! A mythic cunning instigator, legendary creature dragon. Um, look at that. The the uh, embossed, you know, emblazoned foil. Um, I don't know, guys. This is a pretty amazing deck. Uh, it looks like three mythics two Planeswalkers, and a bunch of awesome cards. So uh, I'm pretty excited about this. That was the Dr Draconic Descent. Tell me if you're getting anything as good as this pool, because I'm pretty happy with this. Um, you can tell I'm pretty pretty positive, upbeat guy in general. So uh, happy playing, guys. Uh, let's, uh, let's use those dragons or slay those dragons, whichever you prefer. Take care. See you next time. Please like and subscribe. Really would appreciate it.